Hey, welcome back to my channel. I'm back here at the uh, wetlands in uh, West Palm Beach, Florida. Beautiful morning. The temperatures are pretty nice this morning. Uh, the bird photography is even better. shots uh, it was difficult uh, you kind of have to settle for whatever light it falls on but I think eventually I did get a couple with some real nice light hopefully those are some good shots of the wobbler I decided to go ahead and try a custom function number three for my autofocus setting. I have been using a custom function six, which is one that I set for myself. I did have an opportunity uh, once again to photograph the snowy egret uh, fishing and diving into the water. Hopefully I have some nice photos of that. I did something a little bit different than some of the ones I got the other day uh, where I shot some pictures of it uh, with a black background. Uh, I was able to do that uh, because of the way that the sun was lighting the bird. I'm looking forward to seeing those photographs. electronic uh, shutter for some of these bird photos. Uh, I feel that uh, it might hinder the autofocus a little bit and perhaps that's because of the fact that you're shooting at 30 frames per second. We'll see how some of those turn out and uh, much distortion if any there are on uh, the limbs of the bird, the wings or the legs, uh, especially when they fly. I was finally uh, able to mount the uh, 1.4 extender on the uh, Fuji X-H2S with the 150 to 600 millimeter lens. Uh, that automatically gets you down to an f11 at the maximum zoom range you're at 1200 millimeters kind of an exciting range to be at and uh, we'll see how the uh, images turn out from uh, those photographs i managed uh, to try to get some photos of the uh, warbler uh, with the 1.4 extender attached you're talking like 1200 millimeters i don't expect uh, that i got a photo but you have to try you never know maybe i got lucky uh, this thing is like trying to uh, take pictures of uh, lightning I was able to take a couple of photos with the wood stork flying around uh, with the extender attached. With an extender, I, I think the autofocus system uh, was struggling, but I don't know how much of it is is the autofocus system or it's a user error because it's very tight. It's uh, very hard to get the pox on the bird and it was quite a challenge, but uh, maybe I'll surprise myself and I'll have a photo or two.
So I hope you get something out of this uh, video today. It's been a lot of fun out here and I think the camera's performing well and uh, it's a lot of fun to use it. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and uh, provide some feedback and some comments regarding the uh, Fuji X-H system and the uh, 150 to 600 millimeter lens. And I thank you all for watching.